In this video, I'll show you how to download and install Nox Player. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's jump straight into this guide. The first thing you'll need to do is go and open up a web browser on your computer, just like so, and then go to a search engine. Then what you'll need to do is just go and search for Nox Player. So N-O-X-P-L-A-Y-E-R. And I'm assuming you know what Nox Player actually is, um, but here it is. You want to make sure you go to the official site, which is bignox.com. And what Nox Player is, is that it's an Android emulator, so you can go and play Android apps on your PC. It's really great, and I'll show you how you can go and use it. So all you want to do is go and press on the download button on the home page, just like so, and the download will begin. As you can see, it is quite a big download coming in about 500 megabytes. So it will take a bit of time to download. And it's also important to note that your download may not appear in the same place as mine because you're maybe using a different browser. So to go and find your downloads, you can always go and open up your file explorer and go to your downloads folder and your downloads will all be there. The download is now finished and so now you need to go and find it. As I said before, always go and check your file explorer in your downloads folder. For now, I'm going to go and put it onto my desktop just to make it easier. You do not need to do this. I'm just doing this to make this record recording slightly easier for you guys. So here it is. Then what you need to do is go and double tap on it just like so and you're going, you're going to go and get a Windows security pop-up and unfortunately I can't go and record that but my screen will go black and you go and get this pop-up saying are you sure you want to install this program. If you're sure go and tap yes or press no if you don't want to. Then as you can see we've now got this initializing screen and then you need to make sure you understand the license agreement. I've read it before and then you can go and tap install. And as you can see the Nox player is now installing so you can sit back and relax. And then within a minute or two it's now finished and it now says start so let's go and tap on start just like so and the Nox player is going to go and start launching and also I noticed as well you'll, you'll get the desktop icons appear as well um, but it should automatically start anyway then as you can see you can go and see the percentage at the bottom as well and Nox player has now loaded and it's given you an introduction of how you can go and use the app so you can go and do this personally I'm going to skip it as I already know how to go and use it one of the first things you'll need to do though is to go and sign into Google Play because this is how Nox player works because it's an Android device we're using the Google Play Store in order to go and download the apps and everything like that so go and tap on login now and sign in with your Google account I'm going to go and press login later though just to show you guys how this works and some key things I want to tell you is that on the right hand side you've got a lot of controls I'll just start at the bottom you've got a back button and a home button so tap here and you'll be taken back to this screen and you've also got some useful buttons um, on the top at the right hand side as well and if you want to go and get a game or app go and tap search for games and apps and then you can go and search for what you'd like as i said before you'll need to go and sign into your google account in order to go and download stuff but there we go guys that is today's video if you found it useful please leave a like peace